This is an arthroscopic example of a patient with adhesive capsulitis who has very tight ligaments connecting the glenoid or socket with the humeral head or ball. In this example, uh, scissors are is being brought in and we can, with precision, cut the ligaments without cutting tendons or nerves or blood vessels. By releasing or cutting the ligaments, we can maximize a patient's range of motion. And it is my belief that a tight shoulder is a very painful shoulder. And if a patient cannot restore better range of motion through physical therapy and the use of anti-inflammatory injections, such as cortisone injections, then an arthroscopic capsule release is not an unreasonable way to restore the rest of the range of motion. At this point in the video, a shaver is being brought in to complete the capsule release. The scissors have cut most of the ligaments, and the shaver is going to remove the final aspect of the ligament and reveal the underlying rotator cuff muscle underneath the ligament. Once the ligaments have been completely released, the arthroscope is removed from the shoulder, the shoulder is manipulated to ensure that there is full range of motion, and then the patient is referred to physical therapy, which is commences the first day after surgery and continues five days a week for the first three weeks postoperatively. This video shows the thickness of the ligaments towards the left side of the screen. The ligaments are normally only one millimeter thick.